Hi everyone, welcome back to the Sunday Mini Cooking Channel and thank you all for tuning into this great video. Today I've actually got quite a fun recipe that I love making all the time guys. For today I'm going to show you all how to make homemade beef burgers. Who does not love a good burger? So if you like burgers, stay tuned and let's get into this. Dark soy sauce, some mustard, sweet chilli, one large onion, two eggs and 300 grams of beef mince. Begin to slice your large onion. I would say slice them very, very, very finely because we're also going to dice them. The reason why we need to ensure that it's small and nicely sliced is because it's going to go into the beef burgers. So I'm going to literally take different sections of the onion and I'm going to dice them as small as I can. You're not really supposed to see them. So if it does help, you can also use a grater. I've seen some great recipes and people actually just grate the onions because it just helps it to be very, very small and finely diced. So with me, I'm gonna do old school and I'm gonna use my knife and dice these very, very finely. Alrighty guys, so now that your onions are nicely diced to very, very small fine pieces, we're now gonna go straight in there and we're gonna begin to bind this beef to make the burger. I'm gonna bring on over the other stuff and I'm gonna show you guys how I mix it all together and get into it. Alrighty guys, let's go straight in there and let's begin to bind all the ingredients together so we can make our homemade burger. So for the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start off by adding in my sweet chili. Now this is optional. I love sweet chili and I love honey. So I'm gonna add just sweet chili for this recipe. It just gives it a really good kick and it adds a great flavour to the burgers. So you don't have to use it, but if you do and you want the Jessica's touch, then I say add in some sweet chilli. The next thing I'm going to do now, I'm going to just add in my mustard, my dark soy sauce, and I'm going to go in there, I'm just going to begin to bind them together with my hands. This dish can get very, very messy guys, so if you don't really enjoy using your hands, make sure you wear some gloves if you don't want to get any of this within your nails, your fingertips. If you do enjoy binding your hands, then go for it. Okay guys, I forgot to show you guys in the beginning, but I am going to add some seasoning. Just to also add to the flavour, you guys know I love great flavour in my food. So for today, I'm literally just using parsley and black pepper for the burgers. So I'm just going to go in there. Pour in that seasoning, season the meat. I've just cracked open two eggs. I'm gonna add this to the meat. And then using my washed hands, I'm gonna go in there and bind, fold the seasoning into the meat. This is basically ready. And I'm now gonna make little balls out of them. And then we're gonna put that on a tray. And we're going to bind them, make the burgers, put into a nice little beef pate, and pop them in the oven for them to make. What I've now done, I've also added the diced up onions into the beef. And I'm just also gonna use my hands now and bind that all together. Don't wanna forget your onions. Okay guys, so let's begin to bind these into nice beef patties, put them on the tray and we're going to bake them for 35 minutes. Okay guys, let's get into it. So what I'm going to do, I do want them to be quite thick and big, so I like to get a bit of flour, this is just for me, to help me bind them. And the flour literally just helps me to bind the patties together. That's how I'm going to make and I'm just going to pop that on the tray. And all you have to do is just take your time and do the same for all the other beef patties. So this is how it comes out. So I've laid it out nice and spaced out on the tray so that it all cooks well together in the oven. I'm gonna pop these in the oven and let these cook for 35 minutes. And once they're all nice and done, I'll bring them back to show you the end result. That is it, we'll come to the end of this great, fun video, guys. So this is the end result of our homemade burgers. I've just got in there and I've just put some cheese as well because I do love a bit of cheese in my burger. But if you do not like it, you don't have to put cheese. You can put whatever you like and get some lettuce, some tomato, just to finish it off. But this is ready to serve to all friends and family. Thank you for tuning in and I hope to see you guys next week Sunday. God bless. Bye.